started off show riding and I found that I really wasn't, get, like apart from the Royals, it really wasn't getting me anywhere. But to get to Grand Prix is such, you've got to be so perfect with everything. Yeah, I just felt that was me. <laughs> I started competing dressage two years ago, seriously, but before that it was just pony club dressage and stuff, yeah. Um, Rolando is 16-3 Bay Gelding by Regalo Moir, and he's eight years old and this is really his fifth Pre St George level test. Uh, so far it has, I had trouble putting my bridle back together because it, it just wouldn't work, but apart from that it's been good. Um, I have to say a lot of commitment because between a job and to be able to pay for your entries and keeping your horse fit and sound is probably the biggest thing. I'd have to say talent, because if they haven't got the talent to get there, then yeah, no matter how well you're training, they just can't do it. Um, I'd have to say Brett Parbury, because even after losing his horse victory salute, he's just so like confident enough to keep going and find himself another horse to be able to get to the Olympics this year. Um, enough to be able to do the freestyle. <laughs> I'd like to see it out in public a lot more because I know you see a lot of tennis, a lot of golf and all that, you never really see equestrian and it really is a fun sport and a lot of commitment goes into it. You could fit the public to see that. <laughs>